already dived in. But here we are at Waffle House. We love Waffle House. The first time we had Waffle House was in Nashville just before Demon Hunter concert. It's amazing. It's greasy, it's fast, it's delicious, and it's cheap. I got steak and eggs for less than 10 bucks. Steak and eggs, baby. And tomatoes, because southern things, you know? So. Welcome to the Great Smoky Mountains National Park on this beautiful day. Whoa, it's like where the T-Rex lives. We're at the T-Rex paddock here at Jurassic Park. Here's where the T-Rex lives, right down there. If you look at the right angle, you can actually see the crushed Jurassic Park Explorer. Right down there where Alan and, and Tim fell and Lex. This is amazing. Where's Bigfoot, Tiny? Oh, he's in these woods. Yeah? No doubt. In these woods, yeah? There's Q. It's a beautiful day. It's like, this, it's gorgeous up here right now. Perfect. Yeah. This is for you, mom. Are you talking about me? No, I'm videoing this part for my mom so she can be scared of how I'm ha like walking on the edge. That's just for you, Sandy pretty far down. Probably not as steep looking on the camera, but if I tripped here, it wouldn't be good. But that's why I'm not gonna trip. Tunnels! Yeah. Be careful. Watch your step. I'm, I'm watching. Watch your toes. I'm watching them. Whoa. Is that a little dainty trail walk? What's wrong? Wow. You almost fell off the cliff. <laughs> We're gonna dip our toes in the water. Oh, that was a slick rock. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's cold! Oh, it's like it's bitter cold. That's straight from mountaintops. Woo! of the Klingman's Dome Trail. We have a half mile, extremely steep climb. We'll check in about halfway up. That's right. <laughs> Iowa people, we're about halfway, if not a little bit more. How are you feeling? Oh, pretty out of breath. <laughs> pretty winded. Heart rate's up. Yep. Oh no, you're okay. You're fine. Just keep on going. You're good. No, no problem. We're just a little high up. Not too high up, just a little. Just a little. We made it. Sweaty upper lip. Th 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 th. Sweaty upper lip and all. And there it is. Now, last time I was here, 2006, couldn't do it. Got too scared. Here we go. I know. I'll probably need some. Uh, some support because okay. I can already feel I'm getting scared. I don't know. I can feel myself locking up. I don't know if I can do it. You're going to have to go the rest of the way and film for me. If these walls were higher, it'd be different.
so I went up a little farther, but not much, which is okay. Because in order to conquer your fears, you have to take baby steps. And I made it farther this time than I did 13 years ago. Tiny, how was it? How was your experience? Oh, it was amazing. The views were stunning. Worth the hike? For sure. Good. So we stopped to use the restroom. Should I went in before I saw this? I went to enter mine? No. Nope, 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 nope. You can already see it. Oh no. Top left oh, corner. Oh my. It is absolutely oh, gigantic. Babe, holy crap, if I had seen that. Oh. You guys can't see very, I'll have to zoom in. I cannot believe that thing is so big. It's huge. What was it? It's a big spider. Giant spider. And we don't like spiders. Oh my goodness, I see it. Yeah, yeah it's huge. Ooh. Yep, I, not for me. Yeah. I was like, you know what? I think I can hold it a little bit longer. <laughs> this is an old mill. And during the summer, it's an operation just for historical display. How you doing? Good, sir, how are you? You're doing better than me. We lost our belt about an hour ago, so we wait for the... the oh my gosh. Oh no. So it actually is working during the summer. Yep, eight hours a day, seven days a week. Where are y'all from? Iowa. Not good. We get a lot of corn from there. Yeah. We we make the good stuff. Yeah. You do. Yeah. Yes, we do. Corn. Good pigs. good corn. Good pigs. And I, yeah, and I guarantee you that the public down here. Well, is it is it um, GMO free? And you hear on this one. Well, is it gluten free? But everybody gluten wants to know now. Gluten free. My cousin Michelle. She came down with some strange allergy. She went through yeah. countless months of testing yeah. Yeah. and it came out that it was a gluten allergy. Yeah. And yeah. I was like, wow, really? Yeah. Never heard yeah. of that before. Yeah. And now it's yeah. everywhere. Yeah. So maybe it's something in a chemical that's in something that's causing it. Who knows? I probably believe that with cancer, since there's so many different kinds, you got to think what, what, what are the common denominators? Uh, yeah. Air, water, food, uh, one of those three. Yeah. yeah. Somewhere in there. Yeah. And I know that that they can they can cure it cure us out there it's probably in the woods whatever you know we probably always had it and good lord's going to let us discover it someday it burns me up with the i guess you say the lack of money for research and you look at what uh, a movie costs to make and what they bring in uh pro football teams yeah uh, and i'm glad we got all that but man they could take what they they make in a, a day's time or something and really put it somewhere Jesus. Next time you come, bring some corn. Look right. <laughs> you got it, man. You got it. <laughs> Talk about a gorgeous view. Wow, that is so cool. Going up to the second level of the mill. Wow. This mill was built for six hundred dollars. Wow. It cost six hundred dollars to build. A building like this today would cost thousands. Wow, how cool is that? All these logs have been here since 1800s. Just look at this construction, okay? So this was done probably close to, because I think it was done in 1830. So almost 200 years ago, this sucker was put together. And then you said 180 years, I think. Super cool. Really, get the job done. Look at that. How epic is that? It's like a roller coaster. It's like the log ride at an amusement park. So we found where it all starts. So starting here, there's a rock barrier that's been built, I'm diverting it into here. And as you can see, it just follows the trail. And then you can take this lever here and lift it up and that'll drop that down and close it off. Look at the turkeys. Go down. They're identical to each other. Hello turkeys. Be careful out here, okay? Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> Is that morbid? Thank you for your sacrifice. Thank you for your service. Thank you for your service. I like your feathers. We found elk. They're so big. Beautiful. Oh, oh yeah, there's, there's a, a, there's a, a young guy. Little baby antlers. Enjoy. 
Hello guys. Enjoy your meal, okay? Thank you for your service. Well, hello, little guy. Can you tell us how to get to Kate's Cove? Can you tell us where to go? Thank you for your service. through the jungle. We're gonna see a Bigfoot today as we're rolling through the jungle. So what, what are we on? The Rich Pine Trail? Rich, Rich Fork Trail? Rice, Rice Mountain Trail? Rice Mountain with the Fork Trail? Which is off-road recommended. Well, we're in a Subaru. And everybody else, we left in the dust behind us looking at nothing in the woods while we are rolling in the jungle. Just look. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm rolling through the jungle. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Rolling through the park. Whoa, whoa. Rolling through the jungle. Whoa, whoa. whoa. Because it's walking through the park. I got a yeah. boy. George, We were just down where that little church is. Wow. So glad to not be on that road anymore. This is called what? What's the little... Oh, never mind. We're back. We got stuck behind all sorts of slow people. And this is called... Do we want to have that in the background? This is called the art of expression in the jungle. Rolling in the jungle. <laughs> Just waiting for a car to come around that corner with Bill, Kathy, and their four kids. You're going five miles an hour. In their minivan. It's beautiful. It's amazing. It's beautiful. Wow. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Clouds. Yeah. <laughs> but now we're up here, all alone, with Q. Hey, Q. Hi, Q. And Bigfoot. Woo! Woo! Look at our outback. Our outback with Tiny. Honey, what did you hear? I heard branches breaking. <laughs> Nothing. A bear. It is, it's Bill, Kathy, and the four kids. Yep. Guys, get back in your car. Seriously, it's a bear with your kids. Yeah, like, seriously, like you don't know where any other bears are. Ladies and gentlemen, watching this on YouTube, don't do what this family is doing. Okay, I'm not gonna get a close up. One, because I can't zoom, and two, um, because. You know, things. Just don't do what they're doing. Because that is a live bear. A very large bear, mind you. And the whole family is outside. Including the kids. Including the kids. Just looking at this bear. Now, we don't know if it's alone. We have no idea. But don't do what they're doing. It's not safe. Stay in your car. It looks like we have a, a little payoff coming up here for our, our little drive. Holy cow. Check this out. Gorgeous. So gorgeous. So don't mind the light, loud beeping, but there's the edge. Way down there. Just driving on the edge. Onward. So we finished out that trail which was awesome by the way. And we thought we were gonna end up back in the Smoky Mountains, but we just ended up in this little mountain town called Townsend where a guy looked at Tiny like he'd never seen a woman before. <laughs> and, and he liked it. And he liked it. <laughs> Another woman 
Oh yeah, another woman looked at me like she'd never seen another woman before and she didn't like it. Apparently we're stomping in somebody else's territory. Barely. Well look. Pretty cool, huh? Little mountain town. Bear rescue? Uh huh. People rescuing bears. We stopped at two gas stations trying to get a bathroom and there was no bathroom, so we had to buy something. Show them what we bought for me. We got neuro fuel for Jesse, and it says it may increase the brain's healthy nerve function and structure to enhance coordination, intelligence. <laughs> and recovery it may increase dopamine and serotonin which play a large role in motivation happiness concentration and a sense of well-being and it tastes really crazy yeah it's like the more you drink it it tastes better but it tastes like like a weird flavor of a gummy worm but i'm gonna chug the rest of it and we'll see how uh happy i get so also notice the uh the nice little sunburn this one is getting i did get a sunburn today so that's fantastic. So I'm radiating about 85 degrees on top of my skin right now. Look, river rat. That's cute. Okay, so we literally just got back in for the night. Earlier today, when we were up in the mountains, I used my iPhone X, which is waterproof, and filmed some underwater footage, kind of like the footage that you saw in the video. And I don't know if you guys can see, but my camera lens is all fogged up and all my pictures are they have this like smoky hue to them so we are going on an adventure to get some rice to put that bad boy in to suck out the moisture so i have a good camera again whoops got that <laughs> okay so we're in walgreens currently looking for rice not crispy rice not uh what, what was that oh. no nope, not ramen but you can oh, get it. Here we go. Instant white rice. You want nice. the dry kind. Mm. Now Tiny gets to decide what she wants. Looks <laughs> like she's looking at some yakasoba. <laughs> yakasoba. I don't know. Noodles sound kind of good. Kind of sounds like a Minnesota dish, doesn't it? Yakasoba from Minnesota. Yakisoba. Do you think I should get some? Totally. That was easy. All right, nice. So we're gonna take that back and we'll see if it helps my phone de-moisturize. Not moisturize, but de-moisturize. Um, Jeeves, would you uh, please turn on the light for us, please? Three, two, one, and on. Thank you. Thank you. Nice, just kick down the door. <laughs> so we got the phone, it's ready to go. I'm gonna power it off. As you can see, even the selfie cam on the front of it is fogged over. And again, the two on the back are fogged over. Got the rice, right in there. And Tiny says it doesn't need to be airtight, but I'm gonna do it just because it sounds like fun. Make it seem more important than it actually is. <laughs> airtight. Airtight, nice. And now we wait a couple hours. Well, pretty much, I'll probably just leave it in there all night, honestly, and have Tiny set an alarm for us. Yeah. And call it good and see how it looks in the morning. Wow. Yeah, geez, it's more like Hawaii than Tennessee. Wow. This is amazing. Where's Bigfoot, Tiny? 